So, in today's video, I brought you guys one of the best, smoothest, and highest quality image and video generators out there. Seriously, this thing is so good, it could probably draw a cat better than a cat can draw itself. Now, listen carefully, because this tool is a total game changer. I mean it. It has models like Flux, XL Lightning, and Hit Run. Yeah, those names sound like superheroes, but trust me, they are computer models, not people flying around in capes. And here's the fun part. It's fast. I'm talking zoom, zoom, fast. You click a button, and boom, a picture shows up before you even have time to sneeze. Take a look at these images. Impressive, right? Now check out these videos. Crazy smooth, like butter on hot toast. But wait, there's more. I've also found something extra spicy for you. You've heard of OnlyFans, right? Well, there's an alternative called FanView. It's another platform where people are making money online, and it's becoming super popular. So, if you've ever wanted to explore new ways to earn, that's definitely one to know. Oh, and because I love spoiling you guys, I put together a big document full of free image and video generation generators. And guess what? I keep updating it, so it's always fresh, like cookies straight out of the oven. Now here's how you get it. Super easy. Just do two things. First, subscribe to my channel. Yes, smash that button like you're swatting a mosquito. Second, comment, I want the document. My AI buddy, who by the way works for free and doesn't even ask for lunch breaks, will send it to you right away. So, without any further ado, and before I get too hungry thinking about cookies, let's dive right in. First, we will open a new tab and go to ChatGPT. Then, we'll ask it to write a prompt for the type of AI model you want and add any features you want her to have. Think of it like building your dream character. No superhero cape needed, unless you want one. Once that's ready, we'll ask ChatGPT to write two prompts for a casual selfie. After the selfie prompts are ready, we'll ask for two more prompts that are non-explicit but NSFW. Now, don't panic. Because of YouTube restrictions, we'll only be generating the safe versions. But yes, technically, you could make spicier versions on your own. Next, we'll ask ChatGPT to write two prompts for your model and address. You can always add extra details, depending on whether you want it fancy, funny, or completely over the top. Once that's done, we can finally start generating images. Exciting, right? Now, open a new tab and search for Desgo AI. Click the very first link that pops up, the one with their logo. Boom, you're on the website. On the left side of the screen, find Text to Image and click on it. Here you'll see different AI models for image generation. We're going to test them all to see which one works best. Let's start with Flux. Head back to ChatGPT. Scroll up to the very first prompt, copy it, then paste it into Desgo's prompt box. Click on Run, wait a little while, and ta-da! The image is generated. Honestly, it looks pretty good, but it still feels a little too AI-ish. Don't worry, we've got three more models to test, so no losing hope yet. Next, switch the AI model to Image XL Lightning, paste the prompt, click on Run, and wait a moment. The image pops out, and wow, it looks solid. Honestly, this one's a winner already. Let's download it. Now, switch the model to SD1, paste the same prompt, click on Run, and after about a minute, the image shows up. Honestly, I'd give this one 8 out of 10 if I was rating it. Not bad at all. Finally, let's test Image XL. Paste the prompt, click on Run, and wait. Ugh, it takes a bit too long to generate, and when it does, the result looks kind of dreamy and ethereal. Pretty, but maybe not the best fit. I think I'll stick with XL Lightning for now. It's quicker and sharper. Now, let's grab another prompt from ChatGPT. Copy it, paste it into Desgo, and click Run. The image shows up, and wow, it looks great. Download it, then grab the next prompt, paste it, Run it and boom. Another good result. Repeat this with the other prompts and you'll notice something awesome. The images keep getting better and better. Honestly, wow. Just wow. Next, let's test the prompts for her in a dress. Paste the first one and the image appears. Hmm. I don't quite know how I feel about it. Let's try the second prompt. Okay, honestly, not bad. It's definitely better. But I feel like it could do even more. So, let's wrap this step up and get ready to move on to the next one. The second best free website I use is definitely Focus. And yes, I already know, you've probably heard of it. And yes, there are other free websites out there. But here's the truth. While most of them are free and do make high-quality images, the consistency is usually somewhere between meh 
and OK. Focus, on the other hand, has everything completely free. You get high quality images, strong consistency, and a bunch of bonus features that usually require add-ons. Basically, it's like the all-in-one Swiss Army knife of AI image generation. Here's the cool part. With Focus, you get more done in less time. It's super easy to use, very beginner-friendly, and gives you crisp, human-like images using stable diffusion. It even has built-in tools that normally you'd need to hunt down separately. Prompt Enhancer, Upscaler, In-Painting and Out-Painting, Negative Prompt Optimization, and on top of all that, it generates images fast. Like, blink and it's done fast. Alright, let's learn how to use it. First, open a new tab and search for NASWorks. Enter 2. Click on the first GitHub link that pops up. 3. Then, click on Repositories. 4. Next, click on Focus Fixed Crashed. Yeah, funny name, but it works like a charm. The page will reload. Now, scroll down until you find Open in Colab and click it. The page reloads again and it should now look like this. Insert your screenshot moment here. Next, find the little Play button and click it. Then, click Run anyway. Don't freak out if you see a bunch of codes popping up. That's normal. Just wait a few minutes, or sometimes just a few seconds, until you see a link with Gradio live in it. Click on that link and boom, a new tab opens and you're officially inside focus. Now, let's set it up. Turn on input image, enhance, and advanced. Choose quality over speed, because we like pretty pictures more than fast but messy. Ones, click on styles, search for hyperrealism, and turn on art style, hyperrealism. Next step, head to ChatGPT, copy the prompt of your AI model, then head back to focus. Paste it in the prompt box, click generate, and wait about two minutes. Focus will generate two images for you. The first image pops up, and wow, I like how she looks already. Then the second one arrives, and her face looks good too. Nice. Let's download them both. Now back to ChatGPT. Copy the first prompt for a casual selfie, then return to focus, paste it in, and click generate. After waiting a moment, the first image appears, and... Great. She looks awesome. Download it. Then wait for the second selfie, which also looks good, and download that too. Next, grab another prompt from ChatGPT, head back to Focus, paste it, and generate again. This time, the result looks amazing, like seriously amazing. Download it, and then download the second version too. Keep repeating this process. Copy the prompt from ChatGPT, paste it into Focus, click Generate, patiently wait, and then download both images. Each time, you'll notice the results just keep looking better and better. By the end, you'll have a whole collection of high-quality, human-like AI images. And all of that, for free. Not bad, right? So, next we are going to try text-to-image. Now, the website itself does offer an image-to-video option, but I tested it and honestly, the quality was not it. Plus, you need credits for that one. And we like free stuff, right? So instead, we'll use the best free image-to-video generator out there, Magi AI. It used to be called Daijin, but Daijin is no longer free. R.I.P. Our wallets. I did some digging, pun intended, and found Magi AI, and wow, it works like magic. Magi AI is a video generation website. It's easy to use, completely free, can make videos as long as three minutes, and the waiting time isn't too bad. Plus, not many people know about it yet, so we're basically early explorers here. The videos it makes are very good. Almost as good as Daijin, maybe even better. But enough chit-chat. Let me show you how to use it. Step 1. Open Magi AI. First, open your browser and search for magi.sand. This should take you straight to their website. If it doesn't work, don't panic. I'll share the link below. Once you're on the site, the page should look something like this. Usually, it asks you to sign in, but I'm already signed in, so no worries there. Good news. When you sign in, you get free credits. Even better news, you can collect free credits every day just by visiting their page. So, yes. It's basically free to use if you keep showing up like a loyal fan. Step 2. Start a new project. Click on New Project. The page will reload, and now your interface should look like this. You'll see two options. 1. Click here to upload file from your device. 2. Click here to select file from assets. We want the first one B key, as we're uploading our own image. So, click on the first option and select the image you want to turn into a video. It might take a little while to upload, patience, young grasshopper. Once it's done, you should see your image on the screen. Step 3. Add a prompt. Next to your image, there should be a plus sign. 
Click on it and a box will pop up where you can write your prompt. For now, let's start simple. You can write a short prompt, something basic to test it out. Below the prompt box, you can also set the duration of the video. I'll go with 3 seconds for now and choose variation 1. You'll also see some extra options like enhance prompt and high quality. Make sure both are turned on. Because who doesn't want the AI to put in a little extra effort, right? Step 4. Generate your video. Now click on Start Generation. After a short wait, your first video should appear. And wow, it looks good. High quality, smooth, and way better than expected. So let's repeat the process. Upload another image, add a new prompt, set the duration, and click Generate. And boom, the second video also looks great. Wow, Magi AI really delivered. Step 5. Rinse and repeat. Keep repeating the same process with your other images and prompts. Upload, prompt, set time, generate. Each new video will give you something cool, and before you know it, you'll have your own little AI movie reel. That's how you use Magi AI, the best free image to video generator out there right now. Easy, fast, and totally worth it. And next on the list, we have monetization. For this, we'll be using FanView. We all know FanView is a great app for monetization and a solid alternative to OnlyFans. So, let's get started. First, open a new tab and search for FanView. Click on the very first link that looks like this. Show screenshot here. Boom, you're on their website. Next, click on Continue with Google, because let's be honest, it makes life easier. After signing in, you'll land right on the homepage. Now, click on Become a Creator. After that, the page will reload, and it should look like this. Show another screenshot. Scroll down a little and click on Start Earning. At this point, you'll be asked for a referral code. If you have one, put it in. If not, no problem. Just click Continue. Next, you'll be asked to type in your location. Then, they'll ask if your content is AI-generated or human. Since we're working with AI, click on AI-generated, then click Continue. Now for the category, I'll choose fitness. You can pick whatever suits your style. Then, for gender, select your choice. After that, it's time to create your username and display name. Make them fun or professional, your choice. Once done, click Continue. Next, write a short bio about yourself, then hit Continue again. After that, you'll set how much your fans will pay you. I'd recommend starting with $5. It's a nice, friendly number that won't scare people away. Then, click Continue. Now, you'll be asked to verify your account. After verification, congratulations, you're officially in. From here, click on your profile. You'll be able to add your profile picture and banner. Don't worry if you don't have the perfect banner yet. You can always add or change it later when you're more prepared. Or when you finally find that one picture where you don't blink. Once that's done, you can start posting. This is what your profile will look oak like. And remember, the more you post and the more consistent you are, the more money you'll earn. Simple math, right? If you watched this video to this very end, don't forget to like and subscribe to support my channel.